Welcome back to another episode of Defense and Aviation Update in 10 Slide Info. The Ministry of Defense, Government of India, intends to procure medium transport aircraft along with its associated equipment for the Indian Air Force. And we have seen the request for information, which was released from their side. To be more precise, the Indian Air Force has floated an RFI for new medium transport aircraft to replace its old Antonov AN-32 fleet, and according to the RFI, these medium transport aircrafts will be manufactured in India with foreign collaboration. The medium transport aircraft would be used for various roles of transport aircraft, and one of the main requirements was about the cargo carrying capability, which should be between 18 to 30 tons. If we consider the payload capacity, only two aircrafts will fall well into the bucket. The aircrafts which we are talking about are Lockheed Martin C-130J and Embraer C-390. The Indian Air Force already operates 12 C-130J Super Hercules aircrafts in their fleet, and there are high chances that they might go for additional orders to fulfill the medium transport aircraft requirements. The other option which we mention is the Embraer C-390 aircraft, and Embraer has already been trying to start more business in India, so selecting C-390 will be a good thing for increasing defense relationship with Brazil. In addition to this, the Indian Air Force would get to operate a new set of aircrafts in their fleet, which is again a good thing to be considered. Even though the Indian Air Force might consider placing more orders for Airbus C-295 that are to be locally manufactured in India, the payload capacity of these aircrafts does not fall in the category mentioned in the RFI. So, there are only two options left for the Indian Air Force to decide, and as mentioned before, one is Lockheed Martin C-130J Super Hercules, and the other aircraft is the Embraer C-390 Millennium. In a bid to secure the Indian Air Force's medium transport aircraft contract, Lockheed Martin has unveiled a strategy that emphasizes increased Indian content and focus on the Indo-Pacific region market. To be more precise, Lockheed Martin has committed to significantly increase the supply of C-130J components manufactured in India, which is like expanding the role of Tata Lockheed Martin Aerostructures Limited. The increased Indian content is not just for the 80 medium transport aircrafts, but also to establish India as a manufacturing hub for the C-130J in the Indo-Pacific region. This could potentially benefit other countries operating C-130 variants by offering lower costs for upgrades, enhancements and procurements. This move aligns with India's Make in India initiative, which aims to boost domestic defense production. It also positions Lockheed Martin favorably in the tender against potential competitors like Airbus and Embraer. Lockheed Martin's commitment to increased Indian content in the C-130J reflects the growing importance of local partnerships and technology transfer in the global defense market. It's important to note that the tender process is still ongoing, and the final decision on the winner has not yet been made. However, Lockheed Martin's commitment to Indian manufacturing appears to be a significant step in their bid. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned to Tenslide Info for more such updates and analysis on defense and aviation. Thank you.